I'm scared to click this. <laughs> How are you just gonna link me some horrific shit like this? I, I don't know. I honestly don't know what to tell you about this down three. That's a low. Can you imagine Arnold in Terminator getting down on his, his hands and knees and just like whoosh. I feel like to do that pose would hurt so bad. Look at the way his knuckle is on the floor. I don't think I could do that pose. That looks really painful, especially in like tight jeans and a leather jacket. I'm flexible too, right? I could touch it. Like I could put my hands under my feet, but I don't know. This just like visually, this looks difficult. So here's touching my toes. That's easy. Hands. Yeah, I was a wrestler. I have good flexibility. Do it facing the other way? Hell no. You know what's funny? So I was, I don't remember where I was. This girl walks up to me and she goes, excuse me, did you used to be a wrestler? And I was like, yes, I used to be a wrestler. Like why, what, what you know, brings that up? And she goes, I knew it. And she turned to her friend, I knew it. I was like, what do you mean? She goes, well, I knew you were a wrestler because all wrestlers have thick necks and your neck is really thick. And I was like, I don't really know what that means. You know what I mean? I was like, I don't really, <laughs> I was like, what? What do you mean? I've never heard that in my life. It's true. You have to, your neck needs to be strong as a wrestler. I got one of them thick necks. That boy, neck thick. <laughs> to be fair, my neck is like really thick, right? Like when you, when you have like a button up and I try to button the top button, that shit is a little, you know what I'm saying? So when she asked that question, she was justified. I was like, yeah, my neck is rather thick, but. It's a weird thing to ask. Anyway, this down three looks bad. I don't think I could do this. Hello, my baby. Hello, my honey. Hello, my right tongue. Girl. Let, me, let me try this. Uh, let me think. So, it's like, this leg is knee down, bent. This leg's like, the, oh my god, I'm gonna kill myself. Yeah. It's like that. Oh, I gotta straighten my back. Ugh. Nah, bro, that shit's impossible. I got short legs, I'm all torso. You know, that's another astute observation. You gonna talk about my neck next? I actually think I have shorter legs than Steve, but I'm taller than him by quite a bit. It's meant to look awkward. Terminator's a hulking machine. So I've heard the theory that this down three looks ugly because Terminator is a machine, so he's got like an exoskeleton that, you know, is under here. And so his inputs, or his like, Character is meant to be awkward, but I'm pretty sure this is the kanji for fire. And I gotta tell you, I, I don't know if this is like a deep symbolism where like they're trying to show that like the fire is what burns away the skin to make his exoskeleton come out or whatever, because he's the T-800 or some shit. But this is, this is not good. You know what makes me mad about Arnold actually, is that his voice is like a Arnold impression, right? Because it's not the real guy, it's an Arnold impression. But it's like a really subdued Arnold impression. So it just sounds like really bored. I think if they just let him go nuts, it'd be better. Machines don't go nuts, I guess.